Hi guys, I'm back with the PNC project. Um, I think I have to review uh, my video because uh, a lot of uh, people were asking me that uh, uh, I just jumped the steps. I forgot to record the actual step by step uh, of the pattern. So I will do it gladly again for another miniature since I have a lot of German Waffen SS troops. To paint so yeah I will, I will do exactly the same one is this one as uh, you can see it was like printed so the the green the dark green it's like squares you know like uh, big blotches of square and then the light uh, green is just near it and then uh, Sometimes it's on top of it few dots and sometimes the coffee uh, base it's on top few dots as you can see like like here so let me pick one miniature and then uh, doing a step by step um, painting tutorial hi guys so this is the two miniatures I, I work on I already primed them with uh, German field grey highlights from Panzer Aces and then I will mix uh, these two color basis, basic skin tone with uh, this uh, coffee color to make a bit of highlight on them and then uh, I use this one German extra dark green uh, see from Vallejo to add the first dots on it the square dots that are uh, dark green and then uh, i will come back to for the another step so this step is done i highlighted them a bit and then uh, i also give them a bit of uh, the, the the dark green spots on it now is the time for the light green the light green is near it and yeah as you saw in the pictures so yeah I know a lot of people were asking me to post the step by step of this guy and then yeah a lot of people were asking me this thing so I decided to do this step by step so to help everybody painting his uh, miniatures so I will use these two colors German Camo Bright Green and Vallejo Flores Chain Green This uh, light light uh, bright green is not really showing showing through So for this one I use the I think I use the Flores Chain more on it So yeah maybe mix them a bit together So let me see what I can do and then show you guys so yeah guys, this is the final result. So I end up mixing these two that I showed earlier. And then for the highlights, like uh, the top of the folds, I just put the flourish chain one because from a distance, you cannot really see the, the other uh, bright green. It's very, it's very dull. So yeah, this is how they came out. Uh, after they are painted, the rest of the gear, I think they will look okay. I can focus a bit. So yeah, you you take uh, the the primer, uh, the coffee, and then you put some dots on the dark green, and then you also put some dots of the bright green on top of the dark green, as you can see here. Uh, rarely, very rarely, you can see the dark uh, dots on the bright green. So I didn't really put it on this one. Let me check if I put it on this one at least once or twice. Yeah, maybe here I put it like once. So yeah, this is how you do it, you know. Just to think that the like the patch needs to be like squares you know 
and then the bright green is most of the time near the dark green and then yeah some uh, and then yeah after the after the result is after you paint all the gear you will be looking somehow like this although this miniature doesn't have a lot of uh, space to put it i managed to squeeze it there some 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 camo on it so yeah i hope you guys like it please uh, share like and subscribe and yeah this is my tutorial this time uh step by step so thank you guys for joining my channel and then uh, see you in my next video guys bye bye